আসসালামু সবাইকে আজকে আমি কথা বলবো আজকে আমেরিকান কালচার নিয়ে আপনারা দেখতে পাচ্ছেন আজকে আমার টি শার্টে আমেরিকান ফ্লাগ এন্ড আমাদের সাথে আছে আজকে এলিজাবেথ লিস তো আজকে আমি ওকে জিজ্ঞাসা করবো যে কীভাবে জানার জন্য যে আমেরিকান কালচার সম্পর্কে আসলে সো লিজ আই উইল আজকে ফিউ কোয়েশ্চেন টু নো অ্যাবাউট ইউএস কালচার So, it's a great shirt right there. Yes, you see? The I best love. flag in the world. I, I love the states. In my t-shirt. Yeah, it's got good that. taste. So tell me about uh, the states. That normally what you guys love to do, what is not. I mean yeah. in general. In general. Um, well, the United States is huge. Exactly. So it depends on where you're at in the United States. But I'm from the Pacific Northwest, Washington State. And people there like to, many people there like to go hiking. We have a lot of mountains. There's also the ocean. Some people do like to go to the ocean sometimes. Um, in my area, they tend to be pretty adventurous. They yeah. like to do lots of things. You guys are I'm not always like that. So you guys like yeah. really travel a lot? Sometimes. Okay. It's yeah. easy to travel in the United States because... It's so huge. It's huge, but exactly. everyone has cars and it's, well, not everyone, but... It's just easy to take a road trip somewhere. Ah, okay. Yeah. So what you are missing actually in Europe? What do I miss? Yes. Um, well, I'll say in Europe, the roads are much smaller. So I miss the safety of driving in the United States. <laughs> um, actually, I shouldn't say that in Europe. I think it's mainly in Italy. I don't really know beyond Italy. Okay. Uh, in the UK, when I visited, it was, I felt much safer. Uh, but I think, what do I, what do I miss from the United States? Um, well, again, I can only compare it to Italy, but I miss the variety of foods okay. that you can find in the United States, like Mexican food. So what you, means, what you seems like different from the States to Europe here? What's different? Yes. Um, there's a lot of differences. Like the roads, for instance, obviously, I mentioned that already. They're much smaller. Um, I think uh, the culture is just pretty different. Yes. It's more laid back here, I think, in general. Mm -hmm. um, in the States, it's very work-oriented, so people are always working and always, I don't know, it's just like, I think people's main achievements in life are often work related in the states which that's not really how i roll but that's how a lot of people are um there's i don't know i think i can't think of anything else off the top of my head right now but i know there's tons of differences i mean just the way the structures of the building architecture exactly yes. is very different um again like at least compared to italy to the united states the all the houses here are all different and very interesting looking um and it's very architect kind of something so huge and yeah all. the yes, united states tends to at least in certain areas be more uniform like more similar to the uk where all the houses kind of look the same. okay so but what do you guys your um, main food in the states that normally well a lot of people like american food so like hot dogs well, no, this is, I'm describing like going to a <laughs> baseball game sure. or something, but like <laughs> hamburgers, french fries, like a good steak. Uh, I know that you guys, uh, normally you guys love to eat in restaurants a lot. Yeah, a lot of it's, restaurants are a big part of the culture. Uh, there's so many different types of food that you can find there. So like you can go out and find Thai food or Chinese food or Indian food or Mexican food or um you could just go down a long list and they're all if you're in a bigger city they're all available to you so oh. you have a large italian food you have a large variety of foods available and exactly i think a lot of americans enjoy that variety they don't just like eating like a, a hamburger and fries every day hmm. so how uh, normally it's a sort of silly question mm -hmm. but it is for me mm -hmm. you know like how you guys express your love how do we express our love well we're not as uh I guess if you're meeting a stranger on the on the street or a new friend or something, you're not gonna like go up to them and hug them and give them a, two kisses on the cheek like you would here in some parts of Europe. Uh, 
you typically will shake their hand or just kind of be like, hi, nice to meet you. <laughs> like, there's not really a, like, you tend to keep, don't come to me. You do you tend to be more distant, but it, as you get to know people more, like, you you become more affectionate with people. Like, it's a lot of times I'll hug my friends goodbye if I really am good friends with them and if they're the type of people that need a hug. Mm-hmm. So, but in general, I think a common way to greet people in the United States is a handshake. Okay. No, exactly. A lot. Yeah, that's that's nice and um, to know and mm-hmm. like in Australia, Italy, Spain, like the which countries is near the ocean, mm-hmm. they really love to pass their own time mm-hmm. in sea beach areas. Yeah. So you guys really love to pass your time. If in you live beach. close to a beach, a lot of people like to go and hang out there. Yeah. I live close to a body of water, mm-hmm. and I don't really go there frequently. But like on a nice summer day, it's nice to go. And walk along like the beach okay. and get food or something. So, can you tell us like uh, uh, what is the state favorite game actually like? Like the like Europe what, is crazy about uh, football, soccer oh yeah, actually. Yeah. So, what is it? Well, in American games? football. Okay. The NFL, mm-hmm. which that's what a lot of Americans like. I don't. I, I don't care about it, but like a lot of people do. Uh, soccer is not such a big deal there, but there are some big soccer fanatics around. Like, it's becoming more popular. Oh, exactly. uh, and then baseball probably is hmm. really still a very um, there. It's very popular. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, uh, I was watching one YouTube movies. It was talking about the uh, movies mm-hmm. from Hollywood. It's like all over the world is yeah. crazy about films, but you guys is a little bit more crazy. It's a very big industry interest. in the United States. Yes, so it's yeah. I mean, so it's like a festival a kind of something. Shows. Like when the movies just came out, you guys go to watch. It's kind of something. Uh, if you're really into movies, I mean, there's movie theaters everywhere, um, but it's not like a festival. Like it's just like it's common on a Friday night for people to go out mm-hmm. to a movie or sat on the weekend and just uh, see a movie. Mm. Um, yeah, it's a big part. I'd say it's a big part of the culture. Okay. Yeah. So I have another silly question to you. Mm-hmm. Like, you guys really love to drink a lot. Uh, some people, some people do. No, it is like a part of like culture, as a part like of the culture. Know? Like, no, I mean, yeah, if you're a young adult, I guess, and you don't have. You know, if you like to drink, then uh, they tend to go out and a lot of the times they'll go out and drink together at bars. But like it's different um, where you're in, you know, Italy and a bar is a coffee bar mm-hmm. or you go to the UK and it, a pub is is like exactly. Hang I was out trying to say that. Yes, like yeah, pub is where you the hang main out. things in culture. Yeah. But in the States, like a bar is kind of bars are a little bit like not necessarily like a hangout spot they're a place that you go to drink okay and a lot of the times this is not from my own experience because i've never really been to a bar you go and you it's not like it's more of a it's not necessarily a positive thing Mm -hmm. it's where people go and get drunk and do things and Uh, whereas in the, you know, the UK going to a pub doesn't mean you're going to go get drunk and, you know, be crazy. It just means you're hanging out with friends and here in Italy, if you're going to a bar, you're just getting coffee. It is, it seems like, uh, every culture has their own things. Mm -hmm. It's really no to this kind of differences. Mm -hmm. Like I I thought like, uh, from British and uh, American culture is nearby close. It's exactly, but a lot of things, it's a lot of differences. There's a lot of differences. Yes, exactly. Yeah. So it's just like... It's closer s- than the United States and Italy. Yes. But it's not... There's a lot of differences for sure. Exactly. Yes. yes. Yeah. But it's nice to know. And thank yeah. you for joining in our... You're welcome. <laughs> Can you say something to in our viewers? To subscribe in them? Uh, to describe <laughs> who? <laughs> to my channel. Oh. Masoom's great. He, uh, his, I'm great. His yeah. nickname is Susu, and he we he is not to be trusted. Eh? No, that's Ever. not. Whatever. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Am I Thank you, you guys, uh, to join with us to know about the American culture. I think next time we will try to uh, get another different country. France. Yeah. Just saying. <laughs> yeah. I will try my best. All right.
Ciao.